Hi, welcome to Let's Play Math, where we play some games, learn some math, and have some fun. This is part three of our series on fractions. It's called Fractions and Sets. Last time you learned how to write fractions. One over four is one of four equal parts, one fourth. Now, some things can't be divided into fractions. For instance, if I have a balloon, I can't give you one-fourth of it, it'll pop. But what if I have a bunch of balloons, say four balloons? I can give you one of them, right? And that's still one of four, a fourth. Not a fourth of a balloon, but a fourth of the bunch. In math, there's a special word, set. A set is a group of things that go together, like a bunch of balloons or a herd of cows. You can use a fraction to refer to part of a set, like one of my four balloons, one-fourth, or three of my five cows, three-fifths. Now it's time to practice what you've learned by playing Matching Fractions Parts of a Set at shepherdsoftware.com. You can practice in relaxed mode or try a timed challenge and go for a high score. Just match the fraction to the set. For instance, one of these three circles is red. One of three, that matches one-third. Find three pairs like that to move on to the next level. Just remember, the more you practice, the easier it'll get. Now just type Shep into your favorite search engine to find shepherdsoftware.com. Click on Math Games, then on Fractions, and then on Fractions Sets and try it for yourself. We'll see you again next time for another episode of Let's Play Math.